we've found is that in places where we are um, doing agriculture and that also have experienced these new climatic conditions, that we're seeing reductions of around a half um, in the abundance of insect biodiversity. So we highlight two crops in particular in, in the paper, um, so coffee and cocoa, um, which are major crops that are produced in, in tropical regions and are you know, crops that we think will be particularly exposed to the, the new climatic conditions that are driving pollinator losses. loss of pollinators to put at risk the production of, of crops. Um, and this will you know, probably mean that the yields of crops reduce. And so we might need more land. We might need to put in sort of expensive alternatives to animal pollination. So you know, some crops are already being hand pollinated because you know, there aren't enough pollinators available within the farmland. And of course, all of this is going to um, intensify in future.